happy birthday. Lots of doggies. Okay, everybody's arrived to the party. There's about 10 people that are gonna come after the surprise. Lauren is about 15 minutes away. Everything is going good. We're all set up. Hey there, it's Mike. I'm outside in the garage right now making this vlog. Uh, on behalf of Lauren, for Lauren, um, and I don't want her to hear, she's in the house. Uh, for the last few weeks, I've been planning a surprise party with a couple other of Lauren's friends for her 40th birthday. And tomorrow's the big day. So she's gonna have some friends come pick her up in the morning, take her out while all her other friends arrive. And we're gonna set up a party in the backyard. And then we're gonna go surprise 40 years on this earth. Or happy birthday or who knows what it'll be. We, I ordered a custom made cake from this bakery called Yvonne's. And it's a multi-layered cake, 100% vegan and not cheap, but I picked that up tomorrow morning. Um, and I really don't know what to expect cause uh, yeah, like this could all fall apart and uh, make her cry and me cry, um, or it could be a really wonderful thing. I don't know. I think once upon a time, Lauren told me don't ever give me a surprise party and now I'm giving her one. So anyway, Stevie, let's hope this works out. Okay, Lauren's friends have come and picked her up and got her out of the house. I'm on my way to pick up the cake. This very uh, marvelous uh, cake that I had custom made from Yvonne's kitchen. So I'm going to meet uh, the baker, I guess that's Yvonne. She uh, was cool enough to come in and meet me on a Sunday because this cake is so special. It had to be, it has to be preserved a certain way. Uh, it can only be left out for a few hours before the party, so we're timing everything perfect. Oh, there it is. Wow. Is it okay if I show you, Yvonne? Sure, yeah. So, yeah. Yvonne, could you just tell us really quickly, like, what this is and what, what's in there? So, this is a vegan, gluten-free cake. It's a triple chocolate cake. And we heard that she loves a lot of colors, so we, we chose a style. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay, now how do I keep this safe getting it home? So just, uh... Don't drive like a maniac? Yeah, don't drive like a maniac. Just drive like you have a baby in the car. Okay. <laughs> and, then, um, and then just keep it away from direct sunlight and heat. More nervous bringing this cake home than I was bringing the baby back. Because, uh, yeah, it's delicate, man. And expensive. But uh, all things are going according to plan so far. Toyota is out of the house. We've got some friends coming over that are gonna help me uh, make up some martinis, get the house ready, decorate the back. We've got balloons to blow up. We've got si uh, happy birthday signage to post. So it's all gonna come together. And uh, yeah, man, stay tuned for the surprise of Toyota's lifetime, hopefully. Moment of truth, just got home. Is the cake okay? It seems okay. <sighs> okay, everybody's arrived to the party. There's about 10 people that are gonna come after the surprise. Lauren is about 15 minutes away. Everything is going good. We're all set up. So he actually... Uh... No, he did like, uh, it's like, I don't know. It's hard to, you'll see. 1983, wow. <laughs> I'm here. We did it! Somebody's birthday! Happy birthday! Welcome back! Everything you said! Why wouldn't we? It's very trustworthy, by the way. That was really good. Here she is! Oh my gosh, look at this! Oh my god, a beautiful cake. Okay, Are you ready? Okay. okay. Happy, Happy birthday! birthday.
wedding cake. Do I go the whole way through? Yeah. No, just a piece. Wait, do you have a plate to put it on? No. Well, yeah. Wait, so are we supposed to do a cheers? Yes. I think we should have a cheers. Oh, God. Should we do a toast? Or... Okay. This is awkward. Thank you. Thanks for organizing a really cool party, Mike, and pulling. I was saying to Humble, I was like, you can't pull anything over on me. Like, I know everything. I'm 10 steps ahead of you all the time. <laughs> but you got me. So. Yeah. <laughs> all over greater LA I know it's hard and you're spending your Sunday with me which I really appreciate and 40 is really awesome and thank you cheers okay so the the Lauren Toyota party went pretty well um she was surprised by everything I think she was happy and uh here she is actually yeah that was a good scheme I have to I'm mostly impressed at how you pulled that off without me knowing anything or suspecting a thing. Mm. That is what's most impressive to me. Because you're so... I'm so hard to pull one over that I'm just... And you're always questioning what I'm doing. Like, always. why are you going outside? What are you doing <laughs> out in the garage? Sure. Why do you need that extra fork? Why are you... Yeah. And, and I'm that... actually am proud of myself for, like having thought certain things, but then not acted on what them. What certain things? Like why there was a stripey umbrella in the garage, but I didn't even ask you that. But here's the thing is I told you I had... Yeah, so do they know the lie? No. I'll explain the story. I just got home a week ago from Bali. So granted, I am delirious and jet lagged, so I think it's a good time to pull one over on me. Mm -hmm. I think that's factor number one. Factor number two, we had been fighting prior to all of this, mm -hmm. which maybe was part of the scheme. <laughs> Thereby to make me think, why would I get a surprise party? I'm mm -hmm. such a B. Three. <laughs> then Mike had prefaced that he had to work today on a shoot with his friend. They were here. So that, that was I was good. shooting in the backyard. You were shooting in the backyard within the garage that you needed. You even told me what it was for, which made sense because you had already previously worked on this. We looked up the comedians you were working with on Instagram. Like that there was a lot of detail to the shoot to make me think it was legitimate. Although mm -hmm. you, I did say, well, are you not getting paid? And I was questioning that. Anyway, had a good answer for that. Mm -hmm. I had all my bases covered. Okay, so then the whole story was, Paul and Andre and I were going for croissants this morning to Shamont Vegan, bringing the baby. Paul hasn't met the baby, so good excuse. Paul's in town from Oregon to work in Temecula where he used to live, which he's done before. And I've gone for brunch with him and Andre before. And to even throw off the scent to ensure that no trace would be available for Lauren to pick up on. This morning, I even came in. I was like, yeah. so yeah, who so are you going out with uh, <laughs> yeah, for lunch or for breakfast today? Uh, was it Carl? And but you always mix up Paul and Carl. They're a couple. But I did that on purpose. Yeah, I know. Really to good. throw off the scent. Really like he was not paying any attention to like my Like I wasn't life. paying any attention really to what you're doing. Very Meanwhile, good. I was tracking every Very inch of it. Very good. Okay, but then there was a bunch of other stuff. So just a lot of storytelling today that all made sense with like me coming back to the house, why Paul and Andre were getting out of the car, and then your friend's motorcycle's in the front and he works with you guys. So I'm like, okay, he's just here helping. It it's good. all about thinking two steps ahead. Which you, ne you literally never Which do. Which you so think I don't do. maybe by now you've then learned. Maybe, no, maybe <laughs> you don't give me enough okay. credit and I was thinking to, and I do, if anything, this whole thing is like a surprise about you to me. <laughs> but when I got to the back, the balloon said 1983, and I'm born in 1982. Yeah. Which that was just a genuine mistake, right? Well. No, that was a genuine mistake. It was. It was. So I was like, yes. 1983. And it was really good because the comedy thing that you were helping them shoot which is still a very believable story, is very retro. So I thought 1983 was yeah. doing some retro movie thing. Yeah. So 1983 made a lot of sense and still didn't tip me off because all the people were past the 1983. So I thought 1983 <laughs> was part of the set. Before you got there, multiple people at the same time came up to me and was like, hey, Mike, um, are you sure Lawrence <laughs> Barr? Because I would, the math, I'm just on the math. And that's like, she's 39. <laughs> I'm like, oh, no, she's 40. Trust me. And they're like, 
Well, then that doesn't uh, make any sense. I'm not sure about this 1983. How come you picked 1983 over just 4 0? I did buy a balloon that said 4 <laughs> 0. Yeah. I don't know where that is now. <laughs> um, it's floating around somewhere. Um, because I thought that, like, uh, 4 0 is like, I don't know. It's not like, no, okay, yeah, it's you know, in 1983, it'd be cooler. And we did a playlist that was for yeah, 19, 1983, 1983 songs. So, songs. So, yeah. Well, anyway, really good, Mike. Really very nice and good. <laughs> I pulled it off. I'm back in so her I good graces. Seinfeld was even on the television in the house, even though we were mostly mm -hmm. outside, but it and was on the TV. And look Chris at this. Clark, see snacks this year. I'm recording you. You recording, recording me. me. He's recording you. Re yeah. Sea snacks flew from Connecticut. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm still having a hard time believing. Yeah, I have. He flew this. from Connecticut. To come see Toyota. Really crazy. So cool. And he got me. He got me designer sunglasses. This is like a charm that like goes on. Wow. You look cool, right? You're a cool person. These are definitely like for like a 40 year old who's like a lady who lunches in Beverly Hills where I was today. Yo, right? Everything you talk with your pinky up. Totally. Like, listen. Thank really you. never been surprised ever and always hated birthday parties because I never got them growing up. So this is definitely a good one for 40. And I never need one again for future. That was a good one. That's a, that's what about for the 50? Maybe happy, 60. Like really, really happy uh, 40th birthday. Thank party. you. I know. Like we you. all in our 40s. We, like we've been over the fence waiting for you to come over. <laughs> yeah, we <laughs> old. We've been waiting for your arrival and here you are. <laughs> Welcome. <gasps> Welcome. Oh, nice. and on top of this, Mike vlogged everything. What? That's well, I, also I mean, actually I shot, such like, a good gift that you vlogged the process. Four, four, four or five clips. Yeah, but yeah. that's all you need to make a vlog. You think? Yeah. yeah. So good. He knows me. He's like, she'll want a vlog of this. <laughs> yeah. So good. Okay. All right. Well, good night, night everybody. <laughs>